This is a treat day for Mario. Look at where we're at. Isn't that beautiful? That is just gorgeous. Look at look at how pretty. Just gorgeous. So uh, this is the eve of the Sabbath. And uh, I got to pick Mario up. So Mario gets to go with me, which is so wonderful. He's got a really good babysitter, so I'm really happy about that. But I kind of have a, an announcement, kind of a sad announcement, but um, I think it's time. I think it's time. I think this is a beautiful setting. Um, <laughs> it is. It's a beautiful setting. Uh, just before the eve of the Sabbath. So, um, w one of my announcements, which is an exciting, exciting announcement, is Camp Esther. Camp Esther is, I'm telling you, God has blessed me so much. Um, really wonderful women that will be speaking at Camp Esther. I have uh, Dr. Julie. I think her last name is uh, Hayek. Uh, she is an international speaker. Uh, she has written a, a, a book or books. Uh, she's a naturopathic PhD doctor. Uh, she knows uh, so much about health and wellness and, and this is what she does. She's worked at Uchi Pines for quite a while and um, immediately when I met her she was running the country store and I just fell in love with her. She is charismatic. She's on fire for the Lord and um, I just, you know, it's like we were just immediate sisters. <laughs> I just, I just like Wow, it was fantastic. And so um, when I came here to um, Uchi Pines, I ran into her at um, this church that I just randomly went to. And I said, I need you. And she does um, devotions all the time on Facebook. I actually should leave a, a link so you can join her on her, uh, on her devotions. So they're very, very popular. But anyway, she's going to be one of our guest speakers, Shimon um, Moses. Uh, she is from Tennessee. Uh, she is going to be um, giving her powerful testimony. Uh, I wanted women uh, there who can um, connect with with all of us uh, and all of us women and, and listen to uh, stories of redemption, stories of success, real stories where where we have come from the brink, right? And the Lord has delivered us. And, and I want people to feel like, <coughs> I'm sorry, I've been sick. <coughs> That's terrible. Um, see what 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 Jesus can do, what uh, what what our Savior can do, what the power can do, uh, of knowing a God, and and through the through the depths and through the heights and through all of it, um, we have a Savior that loves us, that loves us women, and that we can succeed, that we can be bold, we can be courageous, we can overcome. You know, and we don't need these broken relationships, these these broken men and these broken families, and 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 to feel bad about ourselves and and to look down upon ourselves and and, and doubt ourselves and 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 and, and. so um, you get the point, right, <laughs> Camp Esther? It's going to be powerful, and uh, so Shimon Moses is going to be giving her powerful testimony. Uh, and then we also have Elisa Nichols. Uh, she had a, uh, vi she lived off the grid, still lives off the grid, homesteader, uh, and really knows her stuff. But I, I'm not having her there for homesteading. I am having her there because she is a gifted, gifted, um, how can I say this? When it comes to God's word and, and teaching and, and, and um, speaking it, the Lord knows how to pour into her. And, um, I met her and we, we, were, we went to Tennessee together and we are just, we, we just immediately hit it off. And um, she's got a lot to share. So she's going to be giving some of the, uh, the Bible um, sermons. Uh, and I'm very excited about that. So we, and then if I get my girlfriend from uh, the Black Hills, uh, Jenny Green, powerhouse of, of energy and spunk and she's all about fitness and but she is real and she understands the struggle that people have us women have with hormones and and weight and depression and and food and so we're going to be doing it all Friday Saturday and Sunday Saturday is going to be a full day Sunday's going to be a full day and um and, and Friday will be a half a day but um I'm putting a cap on it 
because we're going to be breaking up into small groups. I want us to really mingle. I don't want anybody to feel intimidated. I don't want anybody to feel left out. This is really going to be a setting where we can come together, women, and really be empowered. So that's, that's the good news. That's the good news. Now, the other news, and this is kind of sad, but uh, I have decided to hang up my hat. I don't know for how long, maybe permanently, uh, on YouTube. Uh, I've really been praying about it, and it's not that I, you know, I'm allowing Satan to win. Um, I know that there are still people who watch um, the channel, and I so appreciate that. And, um, and I know from the feedback, the feedback is always wonderful. People are enjoying my encounters, and uh, they're enjoying my devotions. And it's not that I'm overwhelmed. I just think that I have so much, so much now that I'm going to be doing this year. It's going to be incredible. And I've asked the Lord to order my steps and my days and my scheduling. And um, I, there's going to be some big things happening in my life. So it's not that I don't want to share. But I think the ministry that I'm doing here right now is is um, going to be put on hold. So, um, you know, I love doing the devotions and I, and I love sharing, but it, it's time right now to just say goodbye. <laughs> say goodbye. Um, yeah, I, I don't know how else I'm going to do it. I'm not going to get all weepy eyed. I'm just going to say that this is going to be the last video that I'm going to be posting. Mario is coming with me. Um, I'm heading down to Florida from Florida. I'm, I'm going up to Tennessee from Tennessee. Then I'm going over to Arkansas. And I don't know what else is going to happen in Arkansas. But uh, it looks like that could be a permanent place for me. Um, so the Lord has really um, given me some great opportunities that, that may really pan out to be something special. So there's a lot of kingdom work to do. And although I love sharing with all of you and you've all become my family, please stay in touch via email. Please, please, please. And, um, you know, I don't really have much of a Facebook page. So it's you know, like, you can't, you know, I used to have my Starry Hilder Facebook page and I, I got locked out. I don't know how to get back in. But for those of you who want to uh, just continue to touch base, um, email me. I, I always have my starryhilder at gmail.com um, account and be more than happy to keep you um, updated. Uh, so many of you have become really close friends and for those of you who are my friends, please um, stay in touch. I'll still be doing some Zoom meetings, okay? So it would be great if we can touch base on Zoom. You can join me and, and Pastor Steve Wynn when we have some of those um, discussions and, and, and Bible studies. So that'd be a great way to see me in person live. Um, that would be good too. So uh, uh, just keep me posted. Maybe what I'll do is I'll start a, a list, an email list of people who want to stay in touch and I'll send you a little update. How does that sound? Does that sound okay? All right. So come to the Camp Esther. Um, go on, uh, look up Echo Valley. Uh, Echo Valley in Clifton, Tennessee. They have a website. They have a Facebook page, I believe. And um, I will be doing more events out in Echo Valley for sure. This is my first Camp Esther, but I'm sure there's going to be several more because I think there's things that we really need to talk about. One of the things um, that we just are going to put on the agenda is pornography and how it affects marriage. It's so important. And so we're going to be really t um, just having a, a really great retreat with women only, with women only, free, completely free, uh, food provided. You have to pay for your own lodging, but you get half off if you stay at the Bear Inn, half off. And um, the venue is at Echo Valley in Clifton, Tennessee. And that is at the end of March um, 31st, 1st and 2nd of April. All right, that's it. I miss you guys. But come see me in Tennessee. Come see me in Tennessee, okay? <laughs> I'm going to be around. I'll be around. I'm going to miss sharing all my encounters. But um, you know what? At least you know what, what I'll be doing. I'll be doing God's work.
All right, and Mario will be with me. I love you guys. I, I really appreciate all your support and your prayers. I'll keep you posted. Just hook up with me via email. All right, God bless.